Would you agree that the purpose of science is to most accurately model natural processes even if they inhibit major revolutionary change from occurring? The purpose of science is to describe the physical world, how it works, and how it likely got here. And um, the, um, in doing this, one has to try to be as faithful as possible uh, as one can to the data. And um, the, you know, the advantage of theories is, of course, they provide you with ideas for experiments and such. But uh, a difficulty with all theories is that they tend to channel one's thinking in a particular direction. And sometimes you overlook important, important facts. Uh, one important fact that was overlooked for a long time was the fact that in the fossil record, um, animals seem not to change for long, long periods of time, and, and then suddenly things start to happen. And apparently many paleontologists overlooked this because in Darwinian theory, it was the change that was important and nobody cared much about it. Uh, but um, in the early 70s, Stephen Jay Gould and Niles Eldridge proposed uh, a, uh, something called punctuated equilibrium, uh, which, said, which essentially acknowledged these uh, times of stasis. Uh, and suddenly people started to notice them. Uh, now the question is, uh, a punctuated equilibrium is just a label. It doesn't say what causes the stasis or what causes the rapid changes, you, you know, whether or not those rapid changes actually occurred by Darwinian or other processes. Um, <clears throat> one can ask oneself, well, what is the mechanism? Why do things stay the same for very long periods of time? And why do things change rapidly? Or what is happening in those, uh, in those periods when uh, different animal forms are appearing in the, in the fossil record? So uh, I think a, uh, a thorough investigation of not only the mechanisms of change, but the mechanisms that keep things the same uh, is, is necessary. Unfortunately, so far, nothing has been done. But, but hopefully, uh, in the future, people will notice this and, and start to work on it.